everybody, my name's Christine. I'm the founder and admin of PSSM and MFM Awareness. And today, we're going to be discussing five different ways to reduce your PSSM one horse's grass intake. Let's begin. Number one, grazing muzzle. Also used for laminitic horses and horses prone to obesity, the grazing muzzle is one of the easiest ways to reduce your PSSM one horse's grass intake. They can also be used in any scenario including horses that are on herd turnout where restricting grazing is not possible. A grazing muzzle works by limiting the amount of grass a horse can eat. Grazing muzzles come in many different sizes, colours and designs, meaning that there is a muzzle to suit every horse. However, it should be noted that prolonged use of some grazing muzzles can cause wearing of the front teeth, so they should be used with caution. Number two. Restricted slash strip grazing. If you have your own yard or are on individual turnout at your livery yard, then restricted grazing is a great way to reduce your PSSM1 horse's grass intake. It's also useful for if you move to a new yard and end up with a field full of grass. All you need to do is simply make your horse a small square paddock. It's easiest to use a corner to start with. Then once your horse has eaten the paddock right down, you can gradually increase the size of the paddock, one length at a time. By adjusting the size of the paddock this way, you are restricting the amount of grass your PSSM1 horse can eat in one go. The size of the paddock can eventually be extended to the whole field as the horse eats the paddock down. Number 3. Dry Lot A dry lot is simply turn out on a menage or on a concrete, sand or mud paddock with hay or haylage. Dry lot turnout means the horse has no grass at all. This method is suitable for PSSM1 horses who are really sensitive to grass or for a PSSM1 horse who has gone symptomatic as the dry lot can be used as a form of rehab to reduce the horse's glycogen levels. Number 4. Grass mats. Also useful for if your horse is laminitic. Grass mats are perfect in any scenario including livery yards as they don't kill the grass. Grass mats work a bit like a grazing muzzle, except instead of the muzzle being on the horse, it's like the muzzle being on the ground instead. Only a certain amount of grass can grow through the grass mats, limiting the horse's grazing. To make your horse a grass mat paddock, simply section off the size paddock of your choice and place grass mats down to cover the area. These can then be picked up and moved as and where needed. Number five. Eaten down paddock with hay. If you're an individual turnout or have your own yard, you can keep your horse on the same paddock all year round. Providing it's not too large, a horse on the same paddock all year round that's never rested will keep the paddock eaten down, meaning there won't be much grass that grows on it at all as it will never get a rest. You can substitute grass with soaked hay or haylage instead, which will be lower in glycogen than grass. And that concludes our video on the top 5 ways to reduce your PSSM1 horse's grass intake. We hope you find these methods helpful and that you now have more of an understanding of how to reduce your PSSM1 horse's grass intake. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, join our Facebook group, follow us on Instagram and check out our website for all things PSSM, MFM and RUR. Thank you for watching.